Wow, don't I look great? It's 5.36. I got off work 36 minutes, actually about 32 minutes ago. Because it always, at 4.48 or 4.49, I always get somebody that calls and has a lot of questions. Always. Anyway. Chewy's back at Chewy! And all our bunch of stuff, Pete loaded. And we're in Wood West Branch. I'm in the driveway. You can see the garage behind me. There's no RV here. Pete took it earlier. Took it to West Branch while I was working. And I was going to take my shower and go after work. But with Pete gone and the house gone, Chewy was a freaking basket case. A basket case. So I just threw my clothes on. Grab the stuff that I had to grab, the stuff I was using mostly. I got about five bags over here loaded. And uh, we're on our way to West Branch for the summer. Of course, we make stops back here, as you know. And I just realized I have yesterday and Sunday recorded into one video, I think. But I don't know. I, I have never edited them or put them up. There's just too much going on. We'll get ready to move. There's the lake. It's a lot closer than it probably appears. Probably half half as close as what it looks in the... Anyway. So, on our way to West Branch. It is 538 now. 82 degrees. And uh, Pam's cat is freaking out. Because it's really, really, really high winds today. Really windy. And her cat, the, the curtains are blowing all over the place. And there's leaves blowing up and hitting the screens. And she left all the windows open. I don't know where she and Dorothy are. But Dorothy's been here almost the whole time we have. She's, she's here a lot. Her son came, Sean, for the weekend. I guess he had a good time. There was a lot of laughing going on in there. So Pam is a lot of fun. The two of them played a lot, played a lot of games. Yahtzee and 10,000, which is another dice game. That might be the one I used to play years ago when I was in my early and mid-twenties. I don't remember, though, with some friends when I lived in Ohio. Okay, guys. Say goodbye for now. Chewie's all upset, so I'm going to put this down because I'm going to be really driving now, and I will probably see you there. Bye. Well, guys, here we are. That's nice that we have a birch tree right there because, as you know, that's one of my favorites. I love birch trees. The picnic table's broken, but Pete's here, so it'll get fixed. Um, let's see. So we're right here, and I'll zoom in. There is a lot of... I've got to hold this better. A lot of space behind us, 20, 25 feet anyway. And then see there's a wall there. The spot that's on the other side of that wall is hardly ever used um, because it's tiny, it's small, it's not as level. So Kim doesn't use that spot. So basically, we'll you know we'll have all that open open spots there. Then right next to us, let me zoom back out. There's Kim's house, and that is actually as close as it is. And there's a spot right here, number 35. And this spot, the guy that has it, he has it every year. His RV isn't here yet, but we will have a close neighbor right here. Hopefully he'll back way in, because from the front of our RV right now, in the front window, I can see all the way down the driveway. And as you may or may not remember, I love watching the people come in. So I could see all the way down the driveway right now. And if he, but he's got a really long, like 42 foot or something. So he probably will take up this whole spot. I told Pete that we should just move this, ours forward about six feet. Um, I'll probably sit in the passenger seat while I work so that I can look out down that down the driveway hopefully otherwise we're gonna have to put a camera or a little thing like submarines have up top periscope 
Yeah, but that's the spot we had last year. You can see where the RV was. That's the spot we had at the end of last year. I'll show you the spot we had at the beginning of last year. Well, I can't right now because the RV's in the way. But when we leave from here, we have to go all the way around because it's one way, not out toward the driveway. We're not very far from the bathrooms. So anyway, that is the deal. That is what is going on. 7 o'clock, 6.58. So I'm freaking hungry. So we're going to go to the Mexican restaurant in town that we used to eat at all the time. I just feel like I came home. I just love it here. This is great. This is really great. I love it. So Pete's checking the electric box. I hope nothing's wrong. He looks worried. Okay, I'm gonna go. See you later. Bye. Oh good. I'll grab it. <laughs> See you later. Well, guys, here we are. We're back. Yep. And, uh, yeah, we used to be right over there. I miss that spot. I wonder if we can go get our firewood that we had from last year. It's still under your tarp, love. Well, we could. There's our RV right there. That's, yeah, we'll take a little spin around. Yeah, the RV's a little... And we're going to give Tyler, our guy, a call and see if he can come out here and fix those stilts under there. Whatever they're called. Chewie's probably going to be, ah, they're driving right by me. But, you know, so we're not far from the lit restroom. There's five with a gravel. That's where we were most of last year. Five and six. We had two sites. Somebody's going going to be right in there sometime. Hope he pulls way back. But we do have like probably six feet we could move forward when he does if we have to. And we're back, right, dear? Yes. 